up next, we got Young Don, the Sauce God, losing my toe. Ouch. Clickly clack, Hunter is back, plus the best is back as well. So I recently told you the story of my dad giving me a spanking for not doing what I was supposed to do in school during the second grade. And that was definitely the most memorable spanking I have. I think the only time he ever spanked me on my butt too. He was more of a hold out your hand kind of discipline. And after that happened in the second grade, I think my dad disciplined me physically only once more. And that must have been either in the third or fourth grade. So here's what happened. One day after school, getting spanking by your dad is the worst. Oh yeah, big time. You don't want those at all. My sister and I were hanging out in my mom's room and I don't know how it was for you, but growing up, mom's room was the best room. Her pillows were softer, the bed was bigger, and there was a TV with all the channels in there. And back then, that was the only bedroom with air conditioning. So her room was Seriously? like the oasis in the house, always clean, always comfortable. So after school, that was the chill spot for me and my sister. Well, around this time, my mother had recently purchased an elliptical, which was a very strange machine to me at the time. I don't think I ever saw one before she bought it. Now, she made it very clear that this wasn't a toy, right? It wasn't a plaything. It was supposed to be for exercise. So, of course, whenever she wasn't around, I'd get on it and go for a ride. To me, it was an exercise. I was playing, okay? I got Cartoon Network on the TV. I got some Kool-Aid and potato chips chilling on the night table beside the bed. Nigga. Who used to look at Cartoon Network back in the day? Let me know that in the comments. Cartoon Network was the best after... Oh, no. Cartoon Network was the best. Especially Toonami after school and shit. Dragon Ball Z, baby. And Sailor Moon. And. <clears throat> never mind. <clears throat> I don't think I, like I would have had more okay. fun at Disneyland, bro. So, one faithful afternoon, my sister and I are laying in my mom's bed watching cartoons when I decided to get up on the elliptical. So, I'm riding it, and then I'm like, hey. You trying to turn up, though? She's like, sure. So, I give her a turn on the elliptical. And. I've always been super competitive, right? Anytime my sister and I were playing anything, I'd find a way to turn it into a competition. So I say to her, okay, let's see who can make it go faster. Of course, being older and a boy, I won. Then I was like, okay, how about this? Let's see who can make it go backwards the fastest. Surprise, surprise. I'm that guy. And my sister wasn't a sore loser, but there's only so much loss any person can take before they don't want to play anymore. <clears throat> it's been a while since I did a uh, sauce, uh, Young Don the Sauce God's reaction. He upgraded his little animation. I like this new animation style. Don't get me wrong, the other ones was cool too, but oh yeah. Sup, bro? Realizing that, I tried to come up with something based on the elliptical that she could maybe win, right? So here's what I came up with. The challenge was, my sister was to get on the elliptical and start pedaling at full speed, as hard as she could. I was then gonna attempt to bring it to a stop by well, putting my foot on the foot pedal thing. Why would you do that? Especially with no shoes on? Oh yeah, you definitely gonna lose a toe doing stupid crap like that, okay. And apply force in the opposite direction. Basically, I was thinking, I'm so much stronger than my little sister that okay. even as she's pedaling the elliptical at full speed, I'll be able to stop it. Well, turns out that's not how physics work. And unfortunately, you don't learn the formula for momentum until after the third grade. So I didn't realize that once she got the elliptical going, I was going to be pushing against not just her strength, but as well as all the force that she would have generated from turning the elliptical as fast as she could. So there she is, pedaling at full speed. I'm standing beside her with what I am sure was a very smug look on my face, as of course. I was sure this could only end one way. She gives me the signal to say, all right, 
take a shot, I pick up my foot, time her rotations, and then I slam my bare foot down on the pedal. Not Oof. only was I un- Even I felt that. This is an animation, I, I, I can feel that one. Oof. It kinda gave me chills a little bit. Able to stop the elliptical, but it was going so fast that it flung my foot right into the rotating wheel at the oh, front of the elliptical. I remember, no. this was in like 2003, 2004 when ellipticals didn't have the protective coverings over the wheels that they got today. Needless to say, my foot might as well have been thrown into a rotating cheese grater. I scream out in agony and then fall to the floor holding my toesies. My sister hops off and is of course very worried. I'm holding my foot and blood is starting to drip from my hands. So I know it's bad, but I'm scared to look. My sister kneels down and is like, let me see. I take my hand off my toes so she could see, but I didn't look. But between the look my sister had on her face and how bad my toes were hurting, I was expecting her to say, yo, your toes, they're gone. I'm like, yo, how bad is it? She's like, eh, pretty bad. So I muster up the courage and I take a look. I didn't know it was possible for that much blood to come from such a small part of your body, but my toe was leaking, bro. Luckily, it was still attached. But there was a nasty gash on the toe beside my big toe, and all the other toes were fucked. But the one beside the big toe, that, that one looked like it was in trouble. So I call out for my auntie, who took care of us while my mom was at work. She comes in the room and is like, what did you do? She sees the blood, she sees the guilt on our faces, <laughs> and she knew right away that we did some dumb shit with the elliptical. She gets some hydrogen peroxide, some bandages, cleans up the wound, bandages it up, and calls for a taxi to take us to the doctor. So I get to the doctor, they look at my toe, and they tell me I came very close to cutting it off. But thank Jesus, it was still pretty much intact, and I just had a really bad flesh wound. I wasn't gonna be able to wear shoes for a couple of weeks, but at least I wasn't gonna lose my toe. And my mom was mad, but she was more relieved that I didn't cut off my toe. Anyway, a few days pass and I've started to put the incident behind me when my dad stops by the house to visit me and see how I was doing. Time for us bacon. Oh yeah. You, you got you had this coming. It was like a Saturday morning and I'm happy to see him, as I'm always happy to see my dad. He sees me, cracks a few jokes about my toes, and gives me a big old hug. So he hugs me. And then he looks at me and he's like, well, you know what I gotta do now, right? I'm like, what do you mean, what do you gotta do? What do you gotta do, dad? He's like, what do you think? Get the belt. You know he wasn't supposed to be playing on that goddamn elliptical. I'm like, are you serious? Was almost losing my toe not enough for you? Must you beat me as well? He's like, son, much, it's yeah. about the principle. Oh, which reminds me, don't forget to bring your sister. She's getting some of this too. I'm like, oh, wow. damn, this nigga ain't got no heart. So I get my <laughs> sister, I get the belt, and this time I didn't fight it. No tears, no hesitation. I took them shits like a man. She said, come through, it's a- That was, that was what's up. Except for the end, they got spank it. Kind of ass whooping, but yeah. Damn. Shouldn't be playing on that, man. That was Young Dong the South God. I. That, one, that was Young Dong the South God losing my toe. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. And geez, kids never play on your parents' exercising equipment. Or you might just lose a toe. Mm. Or something more, much worse. Mm. Like, subscribe, favorite. Mm. Go to 1500. What a shame. Peace.